Okay, so here is my aquaponics. It's now hydroponics. I haven't got any fish in there. But uh, my hydroponic system. It's three grow towers. can grow about 40 plants when it's totally full. I've got about 15 in there now. They're all just lettuces. Um, I'm not using any uh, artificial fertilizer. It's all just worm juice and tiny bit of sea salt. And the growth is pretty good. This is about a month's worth of growth on these 15 odd plants. And the basic way this thing works is there is a pump inside this wooden box. It's inside there, which is full of water. It's pumping up this green pipe that you can see just there, which runs up behind here, out here, which is running basically all the way up behind one of the towers. And it splits off to, to th into three, so that each tower gets an equal feed of water. And the water just dribbles down the tower, which is that sound you can hear. And you can probably see it in there. Water dribbling down, that's the roots of a plant that's above. So I don't know if you can see it that well, but anyway, the water is dribbling down there. See it running down. There you go, now you can see it. So it's basically always raining on these plants' roots. And if I pull one out... Oh, not that one. It's always raining on these plants' roots. And if I pull one out, you can see the roots are just growing down like that. The plants are supported in the, a gravel mix. And that's basically what's going on there. Get them back in there somehow. Anyway. So, yeah. So that's basically how it works. Water's being pumped up the top. And it's raining down on all these plants. Like I said, you can get about 40 plants in this system here. It has a solar panel on it, which is not actually being used at the moment. At the moment, the power is coming from these wires, which run across here. And that is connected into this little power control box that I made. Um, that's the solar controller for when it's plugged into solar. At the moment, it's just running off a 12 volt source. Um, then you can see 11.8 11 11 volts. 11.7, 11.8 volts. Uh, there is... This is the control box, so that's my main power. Flip this on or off. Uh, this was for when I had fish in there, so it had a, I had a light switch and an air pump and um, a sump pump, but none of that's relevant anymore. So there's my three little um, th thermometers, uh, which aren't actually in where they need to be, but anyway, they're there. And that's this is the control box, the timer. And it, um, you can adjust how long the, the water, the pump is on and off for. So it controls how much, basically how much water the, the, the plants are going to get over time. So that wire just running from there runs all the way across here, back down to the pump, which is inside the wooden box, which is, which has a plastic storage container, which is what holds the, uh, the water. It's in a wooden box to insulate it from the sun particularly and somewhat the, um, the elements and yeah so anyway that's how it works water gets pumped up green pipe split across and then rains down on the root systems that are in there so maybe we can take this out maybe and there you get an idea of like an established plant just how much root system it has and if you can see in there it's raining down on the roots. And there's a plant that's been in there a bit, a bit over a month, but we've been eating this, so it probably should be about twice that size. I don't know if you can see the, the uh, been broken off. We've been eating it. But anyway, there's the root system, and that gives you an idea of what a month's growth would look like. So the, the pump's just stopped there. And it'll be off for about 30 seconds, then it's back on for about 5 minutes. But I mean, for this, constant water would be fine, because it's, it's their lettuces, they basically, they'll, they'll grow in a swimming pool just about. So, anyway, that's the system. Let me know if you guys want more details, and I'll uh, put up more videos of how I made it, all the different components, and um, how I planned it out, and uh, I'll bring you updates if you want them. Thank you.